and he's welding with no goggles. The bracket down there that it'll be bolted onto. Hey there guys, welcome to Mexico. We have a new project going on and I'm gonna add a tumbaburo to the front of the Volkswagen here. A tumbaburo is what they call a bull bar in English and here in Spanish tumbaburo means knock down the donkey. So we're in, gonna put a knock down the donkey. In Spanish is tumbaburo. Tumbaburos. Tumbaburo. Knock down the donkeys. So we're gonna add one to here and this is our El Jefe Maestro here, Victor. Maestro Victor. He's yeah. gonna do that for us. <laughs> and I will come back and show you guys how it's coming along. I covered up the plate. They say I always cover your plate when you're making a video. I have no idea why. If you know why, let me know because I don't know why. And please subscribe to the channel. Leave me comments. I got a lot of subscribers, but I don't have comments. I need lots more comments to help this channel grow. Subscribe to Where Are You, Maria? Subscribe to Where Are You, Maria? Subscribe to her also. Leave us comments. No, not ignore. Leave lots of comments. And I'll show you how this Tumabura project comes along with Maestro Victor right here. See you guys in a little bit. Here we are guys, we are back here at the combi. And let's see what's going on. Check it out. They're still working on it. Add on some bolts. Here I go, off to see how the Tumbaburu is coming. And whoever would have thought it would have come to this guys. But look at this, I am actually on the wrong side of the train tracks. Where are the train tracks? There they go. There you see, there's the train tracks. There's the train tracks. I'm on the wrong side of the train tracks, guys. Whoever thought it would have come to this? But that's what's happening. Gotta cross the train tracks to get things done. Hey, stinks around here. I think there's a dead animal laying in the bushes somewhere. I don't know where, but somewhere. So there's the train tracks. Ooh, get off the road. I wanna get run over. That's it guys, I have to cross the tracks to get things done in life or not get things done. I don't know, let's find out. So I'm going to see how the guy is doing with my Chumbaburu, with installation and preparation. And the funny thing is a bull bar. That's what it's called in English. Here in Mexico, they call it Tumba Buro. Knock down the donkey. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know bull bar what sense that makes either, but knock down the donkey. Well, we are in Mexico, but I haven't seen any donkeys yet. But here in Mexico, if you like, you're a dumbass, they call you a burro. So, that's where it comes from. Buru's a donkey or a mass. That says knock down donkeys. Or it could call knock down asses. Tumba Buru. But the reason that I'm putting it on the car, on the VW, is that the spare tire is laying in the back. And then it really don't bother but it just don't look right. So, I'm installing the Tumbaburu. Did I turn on the right place? Yeah, I think I did. I'm installing the Tumbaburu and um, I'm gonna mount the spare tire on the front. I went completely wrong and it's gonna, I'm lost. Give me more room Not inside sure. and uh, hopefully look better. I don't know if I turn on the right spot. I think I got one more block to go. Yeah. I turned too soon. I got turned back. Yeah, so I'm going to mount the spare tire on the Tumbaburu, on the bull bar, and I'll get more room inside the vehicle. And then 
it should look good. I'm painting the rims of the VW Combi to match the color of the vehicle, the wine red kind of co looking color. I went completely wrong. I'm lost. I went completely the wrong route. I gotta go back. Ah, uh, yeah, yay. Wasn't paying attention while walking and talking. Yeah, so I'm gonna paint the rims the same color as the combi and the spare tire too, and the spare tire will mount in the front. And then I have a hubcap on there to make it look a little finished. And then a little little cable lock or a chain lock or something so nobody steals it. And I have more room inside. So this VW is an ongoing project. And I'm going to try to make it look really good. And that'll be for when we're traveling around in Mexico most of the time. I don't know if you use it for all our travels in Mexico, but we'll use it for a lot of travels. That's going to be nice and comfortable. So let me get the right road. I totally went on the wrong track. See, I crossed the train tracks, crossed the tracks, and I'm already going the wrong way. I'll see you in a little bit, don't go away. So the, the rims will be painted the same wine, red color, like the van. And I ordered four brand new chrome hubcaps with a Volkswagen logo. I ordered it on Mercado Libre, which is like the Amazon of Latin America. And they're going to be here on Saturday. The guy recommends that I paint them with a clear coat to prevent rust. Because we get, he says the air is salty because of our proximity to the Gulf of Mexico. So I'll take his advice and do that. And then the front hubcap, I'm going to use, look at that, horses. The front hubcap, I'm going to use one of the old rusty ones. I'm going to sand it off, paint it white to match the top. Uh, some dog I'm got run over fighting what's going on now no yeah I'm gonna paint it white to match the upper color of the van and then um, paint the Volkswagen logo black I'll do that myself I don't need nobody to do that and hopefully it looks good I hope so Let's see, you'll see in a little bit. Here you can see it guys. He is doing underneath, he's down there, he's doing some welding. This is the bull bar, the tumba burro. Spare tire will mount on the front of that. So you won't see much of the tumba burro, but it's there. Good for bumping things, knocking down donkeys. He's underneath welding and he's gonna make it so it's nice and tight. He's gonna have some other bracket here he says I don't know or maybe just with the ones underneath we'll find out and then here in the front he will put something where you can bolt on the spare tire. This is a little shop here Alright, I think you'll be good. I think it will be good. The rims are gonna get painted. Match a colored vehicle. It's gonna be interesting. Got shiny new chrome hubcaps on top. Alright. So right now I have the spare tire. Well you can't see it here. I got the spare tire inside, but I'm not going to open the door shake the vehicle because he got this all propped up 
and it's just kind of leaning on there so I'm definitely not going to open any doors or shake it because I don't want to uh, then you get mad so the job of painting the five rims and installing the two mobile right there will cost 3,200 pesos divide that by 1650 to find out how much it costs in US dollars I eat pesos to Canadian I have no idea I think it'll be nice and we have more room without the tire inside yeah it'll look good I think let's see so he's welding a bracket down there that it'll be bolted onto and he's welding with no goggles or anything just straight eyesight not good for the eyes I guess that's how things are done. Seeing the bolt onto there, he's gonna put a heavy duty bolt. Keep it all in place. I'll use this for his eyes as sunglasses. I know all you professional welders out there. I'm gonna leave some comments. Hey, let me know what you think about this. So they're working on it. They got the bumper off and they got bolts there to bolt it on. Oh, it looks like a bigger job than the guy thought it would be. Oh, there lays the bumper, see? Bumper's laying here. Like plastic. And they're gonna start doing some more welding. Go and be interesting. See this here guys? This is solid metal. Solid, solid metal. So he's got to weld the thing underneath here and then so he can bolt on that plastic bumper on top. And then the timber burro. Knock down the donkey. See he added some legs onto it here. And he added these legs on be bolted down here and be bolted here I'll paint it black and then here is gonna set the thing to some bolts to mount mount the tire somehow here and the tire will be in the front there I think it's gonna be cool what do you guys think about it let me know in the comments well I'm gonna come back a little later and check on it I'm going home to relax because I went to the gym, did leg day today. So I'm having a hard time even walking. My legs are so tired. And then I had to walk several blocks home from the gym and then several more blocks to get here. So I am beat. So I'm going home, swing in the hammock a little bit and I come and check on him a little bit later. So don't go away. See you in a little bit. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like and share. Okay guys, check this out. This is the Tumbaburo, the bull bar. Knock down the donkey bar. The tire will go on here. And then it'll get tightened up here. And they'll have a little steel cable so nobody steals it. It's gonna get painted still. 
and he's tightening everything up and then he's gonna paint it then next after that we're gonna paint the rims gonna paint the rims the same color like the van and brand new chrome hubcaps are coming in and uh, Tumaburo, the bull bar will be painted black but it's gonna look good it's gonna look really really good and the tire will be out of the way and that will be extra protection here for the front of the van also and more space inside guys are starting to work on the rims here they're painting the primer I hope they get the paint off the tire I guess he knows what he's doing here the primer is going on see primer and here is introduce yourself give yourself Hello a shout guys. out subscribe to my youtube channel where are you Maria and this is my chihuahua panchito he doesn't have a youtube channel no not anymore <laughs> <laughs> I actually started one for him and we are having a superior beer yeah this heat guys is hot, incredible hot, hot. we got the maestro there he's doing his job look at that that's I can't see. There he is. There he's painting the rims with primer. After that, the paint goes on. And we are here. Señor Victor. Drinking. Maestro Victor. And we got him a. Sol Clamato. He says he likes that because it's not so strong. Una botellita que viene se lo echa usted a su cerveza y cambia. Sí. Así se llama mix. Mix se llama. Sí, el mix, el mix de. ¿Qué mix? The Michelada ah, mix. Ah, la Michelada. Michelada sí, mix. que ya solo lo ponen la cerveza, sí. sí. Una and look at this. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah. That's gonna be painted black. That's hold the tire. That's really strong. Really, really strong. And we have more room in the car. Here we got Victor's son. He is sanding. The bull bar, the tumba burro. He's sanding it, so they're gonna paint it black after this. I guess they're probably gonna paint it with a paintbrush, which I don't think you can spray it because of the car being there. It'll probably be paint, paint sanded. Paint, not paint. And yeah, brush painted. Eso 99. Yeah, they're gonna probably paint it with a paintbrush. So they can't spray it because yeah, and the car is there, right? So he's sanding it down good, and then they're gonna get it prepared for painting. It's looking good. Taking shape. Taking shape. What do you guys think? Let me know. Leave me a comment. I'd like to hear what you think about it. Do you like this? Do you think it's a good idea? Have you tried this before on your BW Combi? Here in Belize they call it combi with a C. North America normally it's combi with a K. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Here in Mexico they call it combi with a C and in North America it's combi with a K. And in the meantime, what do we do? Well these guys over here are working. Look this guy, he's painting it. He's actually painting it with a spray, with the sprayer. I thought he's gonna paint it by hand. Probably the edge he'll do with a spray or something. And the rims, the rims have been painted already. Look at that. The back rim. Match, to match the rest of the vehicle. Looking good. Looking good. And he wipes off. A little bit of overspray, man. He's good because I would have got paint all over the headlights. Everything. Look at the precision. 
precision painting. Looking good. It's looking good, guys. Totally amazing what they can do. That's gonna look sharp. Here his son is cleaning off the paint that went on the tires. And then we got the chrome hubcaps. You'll see that at the end of this video. We ordered chrome hubcaps on Mercado Libre. Mercado Libre is like the Amazon of Latin America. It's really good because you don't even need a credit card. You order, they give you a barcode, they send you a, a barcode thing. You take that to OXO and you walk in with cash at OXO, 7-Eleven, and a whole bunch of other stores. And then you pay cash there, you don't need no credit card or nothing. And I ordered yesterday. They were here today, but we're going to do some detail on, detailing on the hubcap, so you will see that when we when we do it. And then we're going to paint the clear coat, as he recommended, with a clear coat on it, for rust, so it doesn't rust. But this is looking really sharp, the tire is going to be on the front end. Stay tuned, you're going to see some more. Here Maestro Victor, he's painting it underneath and here you can see this is the spare tire. Look at that. Beautiful. And then the hubcap will go on top of that. And that will go on the front of the van here. It's gonna be awesome. Totally awesome. Here these tires have been cleaned off already. working on it gonna look cool this is the other side they haven't cleaned the tires yet you could see it has the paint still on the tires the window finish and they got those nice brand new chrome hubcaps with the VW logo gonna be something out of this world this is one of the old hubcaps so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna sand this sand this all off I'm gonna paint it white and then the color of the van the wine red that will be the logo and this will be white to match match the white on the van and then the logo will be the wine red there and that will be mounted right there here he's cleaning the tires on the other side where it over sprays they don't tape it or nothing they just use I think it's paint thinner or solvent or something he use a barley beer solvente yeah, do you solvent? I guess that's paint thinner in English. Wipe it off.
are cutting those shorter so that the hubcap can fit on there when the tire is there. So we're drilling new holes to put in the license plate because the license plate used to be right there in the middle but that is no longer because the tire will be covering that. So the license plate will now be on this side here. The drilling holes and that's where it's going to be guys. Well the license plate is on. The bull bar or as we see here, say here in Mexico, Tumbaburro, knock down the donkey, is ready. In a little bit, they're gonna install the spare tire. And still, I gotta work on that hubcap, paint it, get it ready, sand it down. And that'll be it, guys. It'll be finished. Hubcaps will go on the side. And it's gonna look really, really good. Gonna look new or fancy or something. Let me know what you think about it. We're in the final stages of this fix up that we're doing on Volkswagen Combi. And this is what we did. Check it out. Where are you, Maria? Hello, guys. What she did. These, I bought these hubcaps off of Mercado Libre, which is like Amazon of Latin America. And to give a little highlight, we painted the VW, the colors of the Volkswagen logo. You know the logo, we painted the colors of the van. And then I covered it with clear coat. I bought this clear coat here. The guy wanted to, to Spray this with clear coat, the guy who did the other work, won 600 pesos. I bought one can for 60 pesos. There you can see it's 60 pesos. And I sprayed all four of them on the outside and on the back so they don't rust. This is one of the old ones that was originally on the van. It was a little rusty so what we did, I sanded it down painted it white and then my lovely wife where are you Maria she painted the logo on it and that will go on the front of the van like these ones yeah the guy that painted the the door he had a little bit we asked for a little bit of paint and he gave us a very little so we thought maybe the color of that of the of the combi will match with this yep so I think it's gonna look it's nice. gonna look good and then I gave it four coats of clear and I give three coats of clear in the back to prevent any rust from happening and that one is white because the combi van on it has white on top and it has the color of the van on the bottom yeah we just have to do details yep and it's gonna look good I think look at it nice and shiny with the clear coat clear varnish I bought so two I bought two cans I only use one so to do all that cost me 60 pesos instead of 600 pesos there was no way I was going to pay 600 pesos to paint four little things that we know how to do ourselves and if he would have painted the logo oh that would cost a lot more that would have probably been more we, we didn't even ask him yeah we didn't even ask him because I have a very talented painter here <laughs> <laughs> Very talented. Guys, painted. I am so happy. Show she my gardenia. Good job. Show my gardenia. She did a good job. And she's gardening too. Look at her gardenia. And I yeah, don't know what else. The corner, the corner one. The that's the gardenia there. You have to put back your camera. Right there. That's the gardenia right there. See? But this is about the Volkswagen. <laughs> yeah. We went off track. We're off track. <laughs> totally off the beaten road, wrong road. So, I'm going to hook it on to the van and then you will see what it looks like. Don't go away. I'll be right back. All right, here I go. Got them all here. Going to hook them up to the van and see how it looks. So, let's go and try it out. I think it's going to be great. 
coming from our backyard here in Mexico. The white hubcap will go here to match the white of the van. And then the chrome ones will be going on the side. So let me hook them up. I forgot to put the clear coat on this one, so let me put it on quick. It dries, dries very fast. I'll be putting two coats, let this dry a few minutes, and then I'll put on another coat. Here we are. This is it, the final look. Check it out, check it out. Let me turn the camera around so you can see better. This is it. Nice shiny, brand new chrome hub caps on a painted rim with the logo painted so it sticks out a little bit better. And the front, look at that. With the Tumbaburu. Knock down the donkey. Look at that. Perfect. I love it. I love it. I love it. What do you guys think? Let me know. Send me a comment. Thanks for watching the video. Bye bye.